Well, the KISS cam is no longer at my alma mater at Syracuse University's Carrier Dome. The school decided to suspend it after uh, a man complained to Syracuse.com in an editorial that the KISS cam promotes male entitlement and sexual assault against women. The guy said during a game last week, two female students were forcibly kissed by male students because of the kiss cam, and they were cheered on by the crowd. He wrote, quote, it makes me sick that in a day and age where sexual assault, particularly on college campuses, is so rampant that school officials would allow such a display to happen. Syracuse says it's taking time to assess the concerns. Of course, it's not the only kiss cam in the headlines. The Atlanta Braves kiss cam caught former President Jimmy Carter, who of course is battling cancer, kissing his wife Rosalind at a game last week. The pair were in their seats near the dugout during a 5-0 loss to Toronto. When they were put on screen, they got a loud cheer. Carter kissed his wife and gave the crowd a big smile. The Carters stayed around for all nine innings of that game. But you see, without this kiss cam, we wouldn't have gotten that great shot of the former president and his true love.